Hey y'all, today I'm having chilies. Yep, I want my baby bag, baby bag, baby bag. <laughs> bag ribs. That's what I got. I got the baby back ribs. And I actually did just get one meal this time. Just one. No extras. Just what came with it. I got the full order of ribs. Got all them ribs. Okay. I'm gonna put my bag over there. Okay, I'm gonna leave that. With my ribs, my rib dinner here, I got the roasted street corn and the Texas cheese fries. Oh my lord, I'm gonna have to do some video of this for you guys. Alrighty, <laughs> before I before I get started here, I'm gonna I'm gonna open everything up and do a little little video magic, but I will be right back. So we have a whole order of ribs. I've got a half a rack of the house barbecue and half a rack of their I mean their honey chipotle which I love that flavor. And with my Texas cheese fries over here they have cheese and bacon, jalapeno peppers, looks like green onions and whatnot. And yep, this is ranch. Ranch. And Chili's uh, Bar and Grill, they did not send me any utensils or um, napkins, but I've got it covered. There's a little piece of plastic. This one too. Uh, oh, put that over there. Alrighty, not quite sure where to start. So I think I'm gonna start with the cheese fries because, you know, they probably cool off really quickly. There's a lot of cheese smushed around in there. And it is still warm, but <clears throat> Chili's came from a long way away. Come on. Oh, there's a lot of cheese. Oh my God, Ooh, I'm trying to drop them. Oh my goodness. All right, let's get some fries, cheese, and jalapeno, and I'm gonna dip it in the ranch. All right, I would like cheese. Mm, holy cow, I can do And cheese is all sticking everything together over here. Y'all can see the deal. Yeah, they're still pretty hot. Oh mm, man, I don't think I've ever ordered trying to drop fries all the time. Yeah, I've had chilies a couple of times, and I've never tried these. They're pretty good. I'm gonna drop bacon. Oh, I like it. Come on, here. I wanna like break them all up. It's got cheese like layered all through it. it was super good though. Man, kind of like microwave nachos. Try to layer it up really good and then they all kind of stick together. Mm, man, I got no conversation right now. I'm just eating. All right, let's see what first. I'm gonna do the house barbecue first. All right, mm. there's gonna be lots of finger licking, lots of bone sucking. So if you ain't into it, wow, that's pretty spicy too. Spicy. I wonder if I've gotten the two confused. Oh man, Moan City. I love barbecue. Mm. I wanna clean the bone. Mm. I'm trying to get too much barbecue all over my face, but that's gonna happen. Wow, that's really, really tasty though. Spicy. Oh, I wasn't prepared for that spice. Let me see what these are like. I'm pretty sure these are the Chipotle ones. I might like the house a little bit better. They're both really spicy, but also really delicious. Every time I think of the, the baby back rib song, the Chili's baby back rib song, I think about <clears throat> Austin Powers, a fat bastard. I'm like, I have a history there. Y'all know my number one favorite thing I'm doing right now of all is playing World of Warcraft. Way back in the early days of WoW, Burning Crusade. Yeah, I think it was still Burning Crusade. Created a guild called Get In My Belly. It was a joke, you know? But it was awesome because, you know, people from the, the BBW and the, you know, you know, they all, you know, not everybody, but most of the, the WoW players in those communities joined my guild. And I had a nice little heyday. And we started out as a horde guild. And it was great for a while. And I forget exactly what happened. I think I ended up moving. And while I was gone, there was kind of a little coup, you know, all good, because, you know, even when I came back, I wasn't, like, in, you know, full mode, ready to, like, be a guild master kind of thing. And, um, there was a decision made to also start, like, a sister alliance guild. And I was like, okay, you know, I didn't have any alliance characters yet, but, you know, it gave me an excuse to make one. I mean, and we never, we didn't ditch, get in my belly. It was still around for quite a while, but most people moved to the alliance side, because that's what most, you know, a lot of people are comfortable with it. <laughs> Mm. And I have to say, I play Alliance way more than I play Horde, just because most most people that I know in the game are Alliance players. Mm. Oh, excuse me. But it was fun. You know, I'll join a guild every now and then, but I don't really participate. It's just something to watch, you know, guild chat. I'm not a very social person in game. I'm just like in real life. Mm. Clean off. I'm gonna try my street corn. Mm. Have the lime. Cool, lime. Let's do it. Mm. So, so much finger licking. So much. Y'all, that looks so good. Mm. I'm gonna let this get messy. I don't care. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, goodness. What a mess, but so good. Oh, my goodness. I'm just tearing my fries in chunks because it's like, it's just, it's like cheese chunks. Oh, my Lord. Get like a jalapeno in there. So, yeah, full order of ribs. Comes with two sides. I don't know if that's a Texas cheese fries and roasted street corn. You have to pay just a little bit extra for this, but worth it. Very much worth it. Oh, my goodness. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know if y'all hear that, but there's music playing somewhere in this apartment complex. Hopefully it's not loud enough for me to get copyright of any sort. Susan came over to visit Sunday, you know, and I've been having some really, really weird mental health stuff going on lately. I don't want to get too deep into it, but we were watching stuff on the, on the TV and um, I just, I thought I was hallucinating, like I'm having audio hallucinations recently, and I thought I was hallucinating like a wolf howl. And I was like, and I had to stop and I, I was listening and I said, I think I'm hallucinating. And Susan was like, no, I hear it too. I was like, oh my God, oh my God. It turns out, it was a neighbor, drunk on Cooter Brown, more than likely. And he was just out there belting out some tunes. He was singing his head off. Probably had like headphones on. He was just going for it. And just way off key too. And it was it was funny. And he finally made it home. And Susan's like, no, shh, shh. Oh my God. So, 
But yeah, that was weird. So I never quite know if some of the things I'm hearing are just my neighbors. More than likely it is, I hope. But it's like, yeah, I run the, run the gamut of weird over here, so. Mm. Oh, goodness. Mm. People are always asking, like, what's so funny? It's like, if y'all only knew what was so freaking funny. God, excuse me. And stick it on the end of my grabby. Oh, excuse me. But yeah, <laughs> lots of weird stuff. Where's my head at? I'm slowing down just a little bit already. I think I mentioned a few videos back and then I was watching Peaky Blinders. Really good show. I already finished it. I'm going to be pissed off if there's no like, like f official final season. I think I saw somewhere they're talking about like doing a movie or something. I'm like, y'all better. Y'all better do something. I mean, I say that, but what are you going to do? Shows in. And sometimes they end poorly and you get absolutely no resolution whatsoever, which is annoying AF. But as soon as I finished Peaky Blinders, which I was watching on Netflix, I went over to Amazon Prime and I watched the entire first season of Fallout like in a day. I, like just absorbed it. That was a good show. Now Fallout is a Bethesda game. Like my favorite, you know, Skyrim. Skyrim is my second favorite game ever. And I played a little bit of Fallout. And I liked it. And I kind of feel like trying it again now that I'm kind of a little more aware of the lore. Could be fun. But I'm just so deep into World of Warcraft right now. You know, I'm still working on like Shadowlands content. I've got a long way to go yet. I mean, I've already out leveled it. But it's like I'm kind of in this in this phase where I just want to, you know, do it all. You know, finish it. <laughs> I don't know what that's about. You know, I'm not a completionist. Not at all. I mean, I will, I will pick something up. Mess around with it for a day. Maybe two. Maybe a week. And then I will just leave it sit. This entire YouTube channel was like that. I picked it up and messed around with it for like three videos. And then left it sitting for six years. <laughs> I'm like, okay. I get bored. I don't know. It's not so much bored, though. It's just short attention span. It's like I, I move on to other, you know, things, other games, other hobbies. Oh, my goodness. It's funny. All the bacon's falling off onto the bottom. <laughs> it's enough of that. Oh, man. Good. But if you have Amazon Prime, Fallout is a good show. <laughs> oh, my God. So full. And then my last phone. I may leave. May have to leave some fries sitting. Oh, God. House barbecue is definitely spicy. I am stuffed. Wow. Cold snakes an appearance today. Oh, man. Where are these? I definitely got to wash because I'm sticky, sticky, and I hate being sticky. Oh, excuse me. Oh, that was so good, you guys. Chilies, baby back ribs, roasted street corn. Oh, sorry about that. And Texas cheese fries. No desserts, because I got crap tons of snack food. I got Hershey's chunks. I got Nutella biscuits, Chips Ahoy, chunky chocolate chip cookies. I got licorice. I just got some ding-dongs over there. And Hostess ding-dongs are my favorite. Little Debbie Hoops got the ding-dong. I don't like it. They're Twinkies. I mean, I'm, I'm kind of over the Hostess Twinkies, but I like those little chocolate covered cakes, like little hockey pucks. I love it. Anyway, so here it is. A full meal from Chili's Bar and Grill. Small talk. Not a whole lot else. <laughs> whole lot of ums, whole lot of finger licking, whole lot of chewing the hell out of a bone. Anyway, love you guys, and I will see you next time. Bye now.